All right, hey everyone, this is David from CCG House Games, just doing a quick box opening of uh, Secret Lair. Um, every dog has his day, so this was just uh, arrived at my place uh, two days ago. So we're just going to go ahead and open this for those of you who missed it. Um, this was a dog-themed Secret Lair. Um, so it's going to go through all the colors. We're going to see kind of what they did here as well as see what the Planeswalker art was. If you missed this and you still want to get a hold of it, you can find it on our website. Uh, you can also look for singles on our website for anything in particular. I was really excited about this. Um, I am a dog owner myself, so I was always excited when I can see um, my dog represented in a, or at least my dog's breed represented in a Magic Cards. So it's going to take a look here. Pop this open here. Secret Lair. Um, we have a couple of other box openings, the Summer Drop and those types of things if you haven't seen one of these before. Secret Lair boxes are really nice um, as far as packaging goes. So, white box here, delivered in a film to kind of keep your black box uh, from scratching, getting scuffed in delivery. Um, let's see here, so let's fill this off. Just some tissue paper here. Nothing crazy. The box is really nice, although I have said it before, I do think it's like it's, it's a, a bit overdone for how the cards are actually packaged. I think you can, they could come up with a better way for this, but uh, all in all, I'm always excited to get some um, exclusive or at least hard to find cards. So let's take a look here. So we'll pop it open, take this box out, and underneath here is a promo. I'll take that out and we'll flip that over at the end. So see here what do we have so every time they give it to you um, they send it kind of like in a box similar to how you see watches come in so a square box it's packaged here trying to keep the cards in place from shifting a lot but as well as filling that large box that it comes in um, these this is the non foil edition so they do also they did also make a foil version I'm just not a big fan of those and so I really just kind of wanted um, some non-foil cards to fit my my decks I have uh, So let's, let's take a look here. So we have rest in peace. This one's great um, I have a beautiful dog just resting in a in some type of pantheon um, But I love the te flavor text that, that we did for this. It, it's sweet. Some are sad. Some are funny um, but I'll go through them real quick. So Lucy had chased every ball, chewed every stick, and rolled in every puddle. She lay down in the sun, content at last. So sweet, um, very endearing, um, just kind of perfect for this kind of card, for rest in peace. Next one, Dig Through Time. So famous uh, blue card here. So um, no matter how deep the treasure is buried, Hunter can always sniff it out. So really cool there, nice little weenie dog. Um, thoughts in there, going, going at it. Um... Next one, Ancient Grudge. So fun, fun little modern card here. Flashback, destroy artifact. Um, here you have a... Um, <laughs> the word escapes me for the name of this dog. Um, a pug, sorry. <laughs> sorry, you got a pug here. Uh, looking into the mirror, which I love. You know, It's an ancient grudge, right? Uh, Shelby locked eyes with the ferocious creature as the glass began to crack. With one more lunge, she would break through and confront her nemesis at last. So, uh, pretty funny. Um, great card. You find this in a lot of um, a lot of common modern decks, and um, you know, um, something you'll find in battle boxes and cubes, those types of things. So, a nice addition. And here's my favorite: is the lightning greaves. Um, love it. So here we have uh, not just a corgi, but uh, a corgi that really resembles my own. Um, so I really like it. Uh, obviously, Greaves is a staple for so many Commander decks out there, um, so I was excited to get actually a couple of these boxes for my deck. Um, and the flavor text reads, The boots demonstrated many strange magical properties, but the most remarkable was their ability to withstand Wesley's ferocious chewing. So, really cool. Uh, big fan. I would love this as actually a playmat. Um, I think that'd be be great and perfect. So... Uh, fun stuff here. Uh, for those of you who missed it, you can always find these cards uh, as far as the designs and pictures. You can find them on the Secret Lair website uh, for Magic. Or once again, you can check our website for some of the singles or if we uh, how many sealed boxes we have left available for sale. Um, finally, you do get a promo card. Um, you get a Yang, a uh, Yangu. Um, I think this is the same one. I happen to already open a couple of these boxes, and this is the same one I've been getting. Um, and it has a little dog in there. So... Pretty fun. Um, yeah, that's it, guys. So thanks so much for watching, and check out all the rest of our box videos.